and welcome back to my channel. I am Mrs. P. Tarleton. If you're new here, welcome. I'm glad you're here. Today I wanted to show you how to make this smart photo frame. I know in my Bitmoji classrooms, I have a lot of posters that I would like to rotate through. And I thought, wow, this photo frame that changes pictures gave me the inspiration to create one for my Bitmoji classroom. So let's dive in and get started. So here I have my basic classroom setup, and I have a transparent frame setup. If I drag this down, you can see that you can see right through it. It doesn't have to be transparent, but I kind of like to layer it. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to start with a blank presentation, and we're going to change the backgrounds of each of these slides. So I started with this one I found. I really liked it. If I go to background, choose image, and I just typed inspirational posters. These are all free to use. And I thought this one would be another good one to use in the classroom. I'm looking for ones that are similar shape to my slide. If I want to use these other sizes, I would just kind of keep them consistent and use them all the same shape and then just adjust my size of my slide. So let's insert that one. If I go up here to this drop down arrow, I can just pick a blank slide, click on it and change the background, choose my image, still searching under inspirational posters, still looking for other ones that I'd like to use that have a similar shape. These will rotate around so here I have five different images that I'm going to rotate through. So once you have your presentation, what you're going to need is Creator Studio. So if you don't have it, you want to go to add-ons and you want to get add-ons and you want to add Creator Studio. I'm using the free version. I want to create a GIF. See down here, it's working on it. It will turn any slide presentation that you create into a GIF. I like to increase this one a little bit bigger. Usually about 800 works well for me. And I like the time a little quicker than two seconds, maybe three to five seconds. That's how fast your photos are going to change every three seconds. Animated GIF and go. Once it's done rendering, that means you can go right here and download your file. It will go to your downloads on your computer. So go back to my room. This is the slide that I want to put it on. I'm going to insert image, upload from my computer. It's in my downloads. And notice it's already changing. I'm just going to shrink it down to the right size. And because I do have a transparent frame, I can actually layer this and have the frame right over it. Stretch it out a little bit. If you don't have a transparent frame, you would want to just do this like I'm doing now and make it fit in there the best you can. But because I do have a transparent frame, currently I have my GIF highlighted. That's my pictures that I put on this smart photo frame. And I'm going to arrange it and I'm going to send it to the back. And now it's just behind the frame. So now it looks like the frame is a smart photo frame. This is how you create a smart photo frame for your Bitmoji classroom. How would you use this? Do you like this idea? Do you have a smart frame in your home? I've been wanting one. I need a smart photo frame for my house, but for now I can do it for free with my Bitmoji scenes. Hope you found this helpful and remember, step out and be uniquely wonderful you. Have a great day.